Hi friends. I hope you're having a great morning or afternoon or whatever time it is for you right now. So for today's movement challenge, we're going to play a game called Beat Your Best Time. So in order to play this game, you can do it many different ways, but the two ways that I like to do it best are either to pick a space to run, like maybe it is the sidewalk in front of your house, maybe it is the length of your backyard, maybe it is around the block, maybe it's the length of the field at the park, whatever it is, so pick a distance and have your grown up time you running that distance you can do other motions too, like maybe the next time you'll do frog jumps and see how many times it takes you. But maybe the first one, try a run. And the next time you try it, try to beat your time, right? So you're having a competition with yourself. So every time you try, you'll try to get a little bit faster. Maybe sometimes you won't. Maybe sometimes you'll be slower. Maybe you're having a slower day, but... It's fun to try to beat your best time, beat your own best time. The other way that it's fun to play is to set up an obstacle course, maybe in your house or in your yard, and practice going around the obstacle course and beating your own best time, your own best time. It's more fun when you compete with yourself, right? Because then you're challenging yourself and no one gets hurt feelings and it's super fun. So beat your own best time, either with a distance race or a, an obstacle course race, either one. Send some photos. I had so much fun seeing pictures of you guys climbing trees today. Thanks for people that sent those in. Have a great day. Bye.